Hallo und willkommen zurück, meine lieben Freunde. Ich bin's, euer Odo. Äh, zurück in diesem Elysium. Das letzte Mal haben wir den Kryptozoologen Morell und seinen Kompanion Gary gefunden. Der Gary scheint ein ekelhafter Nazi zu sein. Er ist einer, der schwach ist und ähm, nicht ganz gut in die Measure Head. Ähm, Wir haben den Auftrag von Morell gekriegt, dass wir die Fallen uns anschauen sollen. Ich weiß nicht, in wie weit, wie viel Zeit wir dafür haben. Ähm, noch ist er ja da. Also so gesehen. Keine Ahnung. Ja, was ist das? Geld. Ja. Irgendwo im Süden. Ah, da ist eine Fall. There's a trap in the reeds at your feet. Looks like the same one you saw Morel set before. Same mesh, same wiring. Mm -hmm. Look around. Behind you, the ruins of a residential building loom over the reeds. They whisper amongst themselves, confidentially. Snowflakes cling to their shivering stems. When this district was booming, the reeds were kept at bay. Nothing obscured the freshly painted facades. Nowhere for drunks and adventurous teenagers to hide. Okay. Now only the wind blows. Reed the trap. Locusts are crawling around in the trap, confused but uneaten. You see no carnivorous reed phasmid gorging on them. Hmm. Big surprise. Anyway. <laughs> One down, three to go. Damn, I was hoping it would be in the f in the first. <laughs> <laughs> no need to grin. I'm not expecting to find anything. I'm helping some citizens and some fresh air. It'll be in the next one, surely. Say nothing. Let's put the pre. You set the apparatus back on the ground among the reeds. Okay, we hope nicht, dass was drinnen ist. Aber um, ich kann mir gut vorstellen, dass dann am Schluss irgendwas drinnen wird. Ich überlege gerade, ich wird direkt zum Wording in Max können. Ist es irgendwie möglich? Wie, wie können wir, wie können wir, ähm, den Platz Irgendjemand hat gesagt, wir hätten einen neuen ähm, Fast Movement Point gefunden. Aber irgendwie scheint das nicht der Fall zu sein. Wir können nicht Fast machen. Keiner dieser Orte ist irgendwie anklickbar. Da brauchen wir noch eine, eine Suggestion. Help me a little. Ah, das kann ich mich auch noch erinnern. Das ist da, wo wir den Spieler hätten würfeln müssen. Hm, das ist eine Probe, die wir noch nicht gemacht haben, weil wir noch keinen guten. Platz für ein Picknick. Hm. Bosch Benson. a copy of the hmm. vielleicht wenn wir die falsche Karte haben ich weiß es nicht And felt is
Also keine Möglichkeit, direkt irgendwo hinzureisen. Good Cop, Bad 23. Wir sind definitiv. Oh, ich bin auch nicht Faschist. Wir haben aber schon 13 Mal die kommunistische Sache gewonnen und eh voll die. Wir sind nicht. Also ich muss zu Fuß rüber rennen. Das ist ekelhaft. Da haben wir den Dings gesehen. Aber hinten reinkommen wir nicht. Ich meine, wir könnten nochmal da rauf rennen, weil wir hatten da hinten einen Eingang irgendwo hin, wo wir noch nicht reingegangen sind. Nicht da irgendwo. Schau, da sind noch Sachen. Was ist das? Someone has left an unidentifiable article of clothing on this railing. It smells really bad. The cloth if you can still call it that, makes a soft crunching sound as you thrust your finger into it. It's streaked with dried seagull shit and tangled with pieces of seaweed. A dangling arm suggests that there might be a jacket beneath the crust of filth. Ah, das könnte die Jacke von dem einen, von dem einen Typ sein. It seems likely that it was left in the surf until someone laid it out on this fence to dry out. Unfortunately, that just seems to have stiffened it into a shapeless mass. Please tell me you're not taking that with you. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is the jacket the idiot doom spiral guy wanted me to find. I'm sure he'll be thrilled to have it returned. <laughs> Filthy jacket. Use interact button to, in inventory to inspect the item. Das wurde doch die Art. Wo ist die Jacke? Wo ist die Jacke? Wo ist die? Ah nein, Interact, die kann man gar nicht an. Filthy Racket. Oh Gott, oh Gott. Filthy Rack has been at the mercy of the elements for quite some time. It's speaked with seagull shit and if from knows what natural processes you can't even tell what brand it is. As you hold it in your hands, it makes an uncomfortable crunching sound. Man, how did this jacket get so this thing? It's a sordid, filthy tale. Not for the weak. Are you sure you can stomach it? Think about it, don't think about it. Yeah, think about it. It occurs to you that you're not even holding the jacket itself, but rather the thick crust of jetsam and seagull shit that ensconces it. Thank you. It smells like a dead sea creature. Tangled in grey strands of seaweed. It must have spent quite some time in the water before the tide deposited it ashore. Gross. Okay, what's the crust? Somehow, it was carried or dragged to the boardwalk. If not by human hands, then perhaps the feral dogs that prowl the beaches at night. Mm. The faint impressions of many footprints are also present. Though it's impossible to tell what kind or how many. Suffice to say, the jacket spent some time on the ground before someone draped it over the railing. Okay, that's pretty disgusting. I've had enough. What happened once someone put it on the railing? The crust is hard. This jacket spent at least a day baking in the sun. Who knows what happened to it then? Somewhere high above the city, a pair of seagulls trace loops through the air. They are like the bombardiers of the aerostatic brigades, <laughs> gliding above a target-rich environment. Okay. All of a sudden, the Bombay doors open, and their white glittering payload rushes <laughs> to the ground. That's a very good idea. Okay, so the movie we have already shot. Splat, an explosion of white on a man's shoe. A curse goes up, but the birds do not hear. Why did I just spend all this time thinking about this? 
But shit. It's too late. You already thought about it. And now your hands are covered in muck. <laughs> Maybe if I wipe my hands on my pants. Then. Now you're just flicking that shit everywhere. This is a disaster. You'll never get the smell out. Danke, Kumpel. Uh, ja, das war ich entfiehlt. Okay, aber hier ist noch eine Trash irgendwas. Keine Ahnung. Noch Sachen. Wir können. Oh, großartig Geld. Ein Makeshift. Friends have tried to make. A tarp will keep out neither rain, nor snow, nor wind. Not a sack. Coin-operated weighing machine hasn't been used for a decade. Mm -hmm. Vagrants have recently painted the top water. Okay. Ooh, Mega Binals prescription lenses plus two encyclopedia minus one perception. Not bitter. Was kann das noch? Enzyklopädie, nicht schlecht. Wie muss man das Perception? Whose idiotic idea were square and beige plastic frames anyway? Beige color that does not look good on anyone. Not to mention that seeing the world through these enzyklopädie lenses feels almost Encyclopedia, discover your inner bino. No sense using. Ah, no, you can't do this. Not dance. Well, that's it. Not dance. In some more fair plus ends, we should. Oh, or that's it. More some more fair minus ends. Or that's it. We should calculate this minus ends. Will I also not? What's the D? Plus minus ends. Logic. Okay. Was kann? Gar nichts. Wir könnten. Tribar öffnen und ziehen. Ah, jetzt ist es blau. Postcard Coron 33. Mhm. Ich glaube, das kann man einfach mal an. This one has hell written on its back. It could not be further from the truth. It's the boom years and Coron, the nicest district in Russia. Drawing a sun-drenched day, tall and handsome buildings rise from the riverside steel, iron and yellow limestone, with cloud shadows sliding on the facades. Hmm. Net. Hmm. <laughs> Net. So, kommen wir da nach rückwärts irgendwie? Big wine canister, it's open and empty. Bin ich sicher, wir hätten den Wein noch. Smell, it's awful and familiar. Hold on, that is. It doesn't help. You can still smell it. What is it? Don't you recognize it? That idiot's pungency, that faintly cloying sweetness. Only death smells like that. Okay. Something cold wakes in the pit of your stomach. Fear. It is death. It must be. Okay. The lieutenant has already brought a handkerchief to his nose. 
Eyes up, detective. Something's not right here. Okay. Careful there. These robots look rotten. And weak. Okay, there's an a person. There's some tear. An empty cigarette package and a crumpled kebab wrapper in the trash bin. Examine the tear. Two empty bottles of Tallulah vodka and a can of black potent porter is all you find. Okay. No, there's more in there. Livis strawberry liquor. Plus some pills in the bottles, too. Better not pick them up. They seem unhygienic. A tragedy. Hmm. Examine the cigarette package. Whoever tossed it here was a heavy smoker. The brand name reads Red Astra. Hmm. Red Astra is the black market version of <laughs> Astra cigarettes, known for their high tar content. <laughs> Examine the you see wrapped. traces of mayonnaise and ketchup on it, as well as a tomato wedge. The wrapper reads, Shish Kebab Revachon. Hmm. It's no older than a day or two. No mold yet. Okay. It's hard to concentrate in the smell. The sea air brings some relief. A man lies on the boardwalk. His limbs bent and neck turned at an unnatural angle. Right next to him is an empty bottle of spirits. In his cramped hand, a chewing gum wrapper. Okay, this man is tall. The smell is not as bad as a two-week-old corpse, but it's definitely heading there. Okay. Hold on. Two bulging eyes stare back at me. I guess they said someone stop. Well, it's not seeing nothing. <sighs> Lividity is faintly pronounced. Whoever this is has been dead for two days. No longer. We need to investigate. Miss Lydia? Another dead body. This is your job. Steal yourself. Oh, thank you for it. Calm now. Carefully. Just another day. Just another dead body. Breathe. Start a man's clothes. He's wearing mud caked boots, beige trousers, and an old brown leather jacket with a bright blue lining. There are traces of kebab sauce on his chest. So this you find some sunflower seeds and a rain soaked library card folded into two. His jacket feels sodden and heavy under your hand. Good. We should take a look at that library card after this is done. Mm. And the man has fallen through a crack in the boardwalk and hit his head against the metal bench. Coagulated oh. blood covers his black hair. One of his feet is still dangling through the hole. Okay. You have to be quite inebriated to fall that bad. Well over a liter of pure ethanol, three bottles of wine, or one and a half of spirits. Okay. Or maybe it was just dark. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. His expression is dull, like the sea behind him. Drops of water shining this. on his moustache. His eyes, empty and wide, look frightening in their frozen gaze. Mm -hmm. Height. 170 to 175 centimeters. Curly hair, stout build, age approximately 50 to 60 years. Okay. There's some dried blood on the metal bench, right where the corpse's head rests. The floorboards are rotten and slippery wet around the hole. An empty bottle lies nearby. A chewing gum wrapper is clutched in his fist. I'm in the man. A dried chunk of blood covers the hair at the back of his head. An open wound. It's sticky and cold to your touch. This is what killed him. Thank you, logic. I don't see any other major wounds, do you? Mm, no, just one of them. Seems like the head wound was fatal. 
It's exactly the shape of the bench. Hmm. Having the bottle, like having the chewing gum wrap. Hmm. They screech under your feet ominously. It's hard to say whether the dead man's weight was the cause of the boardwalk to break. It definitely looks fragile. Mm -hmm. You see waves churning below. Something cracks beneath your feet. Okay. He could have easily disappeared into the sea through that hole, and you would have never found him. Okay. A point seven five liter Tallulah vodka with its cap missing. There's hardly anything left inside. Okay, der Mann war also stark trunken und möglicherweise war es auch zusätzlich dunkel. It's mid market spirits with a slight touch of menthol. The man meant to enjoy himself, have a good time. Mm, yeah. Tear all around us. Hmm. Well, the bottles need a coin operated fewer than. At your yellow plastic bag. I'd prefer if you didn't collect them this time. It's not proper. Okay. True. It feels disrespectful. Mach ich dann später, wenn du nicht. Sam in the chewing gum wrapper. Rubowski spearmint chewing gum. Green leaves on the cover. The man's mouth is half agape from the terror of the fall. Mm, look. The blackness of death. Stench. You think you see white chewing gum too? Okay. He ate the whole pack, right? It's to cover the smell of alcohol before going home. The worst thing is, I've seen it before. Almost the same scenario. Even the chewing gum. It's always the same. In a ditch off a road below the 881, he thinks. A young father. Then he shakes his head to make the memory stop. Hmm. The entire boardwalk creaks in the wind as you take a step back. Who is this man? Looks like one of the locals. He'd have to know this spot to come here. You don't just walk over here. Hmm. But that's just a lazy assumption. What do you think? At least this man knew how to party. Imagine the <laughs> same scene without the bottle. Now that would be just sad. <laughs> Don't get like chemistry. This is all so sad. This is an omen, a sign from above, that you need to stop drinking. Thank you, Inland Empire. Das ist uns schon klar. Also zumindest unserem logischen, logisch denkenden Teil und auch teilweise dem empathisch denkenden Teil. <laughs> he looks like me. Could have ended up just like him, dead on some empty with a bottle next to my corpse. <laughs> okay, um, looks like just another old drunkard to me. I think labeling him as an alcoholic is a bit premature. We don't know anything yet. Sind wir so selbsterkenntnisrecht, dass wir das sagen können? Wir sagen auf jeden Fall nicht das Zweite, das wäre disrespectful und Kim würde es mögen und wir sind nett. Also wir wollen, dass Kim uns mag. Well, at least you're not married. Danke. Ich sag sowas nicht mehr, um dir zu gefallen, du Idiot. Or, what if you are? Danke, Inland Empire, du machst es nicht besser. Married to your drink, that's for sure. Ja, well, let's try to not run ahead. For now, all we know is that he's an unidentified middle-aged man found dead on the Martinez boardwalk. Hm. Möglicherweise die Frau, die vor der Buchhandlung gestanden ist und gelesen hat. Hatte die nicht irgendwas gesagt? Die hat da... Mit der haben wir irgendwas über ihren Mann geredet. What do you think happened here? Death by misadventure. He slipped and fell through the boardwalk. A truly unfortunate accident. If it wouldn't have been for that bench, he'd be alive. Hmm, wahrscheinlich, ja. Could it be related for 
after the lynching Ruby Nan? Do you think he was drunk? What about the keep up? Someone should be held responsible. The broken board walk is dangerous. Hmm. What about the keep up? What about it? The deceased ate some kebab. It's probably from a nearby place, maybe in the parks. Sometimes a kebab is just a kebab. Thank you, logic. They'll seal this place off after the news reaches the coalition officials. I doubt that they have enough resources to actually repair the boardwalk. Sure. So we alles andere auch hier. Not that sealing it off would keep anyone away. All it does is keep the city council's hands clean. Right. It does seem to be a pretty straightforward misadventure, although there's still a question of identifying the body. From where I stand, I can see two options. We either take the case and follow the leads to identify the body on our own, or we report back to the station and leave this for our colleagues to handle. Hmm. Hold on. What about field autopsy? We found him. We should finish this. Take the case. Let's leave this case for the state. I don't want to spend time on it. Although I still need some time to decide. Nah. Naja, natürlich machen wir es. Man, es ist ein Spiel, in dem wir möglichst alles anschauen. Alright. We should first examine the library card you found. Then we can call the station from my kinema. Let them know we are taking the case. Hmm. Okay. Library card. Interact. Library card found from a pocket of the dead man on the Martinez board. Still slightly damp. The cover bears the rock. The library card is folded into two and still slightly wet to the touch. The front side reads Central Jamrock Public Library Card, issued to Billy Mejon, expires July 53. Okay. Welches Datum Billy is a unisex name. Could be the deceased or his family member. Look inside. Whoever owns this card is an avid reader. You find a list of books written in blue pencil. Radio thriller. Stand a little less between me and the sun. The last one in the list is The Glinton Curve by M. Theobald. A library stamp indicates that the book has been returned. Okay. Most of these titles seem to be in the sci-fi genre. Some thrillers too. Okay, look at the back. If part. lost, please return the card to the library. Dial 005-02-55211 or visit us at Moreau Street, 78, Jamrock. Business hours, 900 to 1800. Okay, yet some decisions so. Um Good. We should give them a call from my kinema. See if we can learn anything about Billy Mejean. Hmm. Okay, fast. This coin operated viewer has been out of order for years. Naturally. Sollten wir nicht wegbringen? Bevor wir zum Dings zurückgehen, ähm, zum Wording in Rex, bringen wir mal die Jacke zurück zu dem Huch. From Pulse. The music is coming from somewhere on the, on the ice. Ich glaube, das ist falsch abgegeben. Wir müssen da runter, ja. Da müssen wir das nächste Mal hin. Aber jetzt müssen wir als nächstes das Ding zurückbringen. Und 
dann gehen wir Karaoke singen. Das wird schrecklich. Tequila Sunset. Mm -hmm. Could you and your pals sign this document? Aha, sie können wir auch unterschreiben lassen. Have you seen a red-haired woman named Ruby around? I found your jacket. Ah, tequila. I knew you'd come through. That's fucking great, man. Give him the jacket. Let me see. What? This isn't my jacket. My jacket was beautiful. This is fucking filthy. What am I supposed to do with this? Look, I may have just seen an omen of my impending death. I don't care about the jacket. What do you expect? You left it outside for a week. I'm not taking a disgusting pile of hobo rags. I may be in an irrecoverably decaying orbit, but I've still got standards. Oh God, echt jetzt. Either bring it back the way it was before, or find a dumpster to burn it in. Okay. You know, despite the guano, it looks like the jacket itself is stain resistant. It may just need a good scrubbing. <laughs> Danke. Ich hätte auch verbrannt, wenn es sein muss. Could you and your pals sign this? No, I'm trying to test my Ruby. I can't really remember seeing any women after losing my keys. It's a touchy topic. He hasn't got laid in ages. Ja, ich, ich nehme mal an, wir auch nicht. He really has no idea who this Ruby is, sire. Danke, Drama. Have you got any more men? What's it about? Uh, I'll let my hand address the situation. Maybe you've heard. I used to be a very successful business. Yeah, we have heard that. I signed more than a few lease forms or whatever the fuck they were. Anyone's got a pen? The pro's gonna do it. Yes, I have this green ape one. All right. Mm -hmm. Next to Lillian's signature. Idiot Doom Sparrow. I need at least two signatures on. Hey, Abs! Hey, Abs! Mm -hmm. Don't you? You call Abigail? I need you to sign this document right here. It's important. Okay. Don't call her. His trembling hand catches the paperwork. He lays it out on his knees and starts writing slowly. The handwriting is almost illegible due to his shaky hands. Don't call Abaclaw. <sighs> Great job, Abs. Nailed it. He hands it back to you. Oh, can I have a pen back too? Don't know if I've mentioned it, but I used to be a businessman. And as a businessman, I'm going to keep the pen for my trouble. <laughs> no, that was my favorite thing of all the things you have. Echt? Was das? You've done a great service to the village of to the RCM and to Revachol. Hey, guys. We're heroes. <laughs> About fucking time, man. I've done my duty. Don't call Abigail! No. Thank you for your services, gentlemen. Should we go and mail this? I think I sold Mailbox on the plaza. Yep. Mailbox Plaza got it. Ausgezeichnet. White envelope. Interact. You take the legal documents out of the envelope. A 12 to 40 month construction period and the zoning plan in the addendum. It's signed by Idiot Doom Spiral <laughs> and someone called Blanco Abigail, apparently. Bast. 
wir haben jemanden gefunden, Get Signatures for Abroad. Na gut, ähm. Oh. ID. Mhm. Zurück zu dem lieben Wording in Rex. Hier Karaoke singen. Das ist schon nach 19 Uhr. Mit dem Wording in Rex ist außerdem ein. Da wir den Brief reinwerfen. Alles wird gut. Und hoch hier war das. Ähm The dented yellow mailbox greets you with its graffito and bullet holes in the front. Okay. Drop the white envelope into the mailbox. You drop the white envelope in the darkness. It lands with a soft thud on what sounds like a couple of letters. Mm -hmm. About a week's worth of mail has collected in there. They'll empty this very soon. Okay. Probably did the right thing. You can't trust that slug ever up. You know he's going to play you somehow. Mm. All right, let's go back to Ebrard. If we don't mention anything to him, he won't know before it's too late. Mm -hmm. Aber zuerst wird Karaoke gesungen. Karaoke, Karaoke. Wir geben außerdem den Vogel an Bart. Vielleicht mag er uns dann mehr. Immerhin, er, er sollte uns sowieso schon mögen. Wir haben herausgefunden, was hinter dem Ding ist. Wir könnten auch mit Lena reden. Und da sind noch die zwei Polizisten. Hm. Okay, wir reden mit Guard und nehmen noch das Ding und dann noch mit Can I help you? Guard, I found a new bird for the wording. Give him this, the rough grouse. What is this thing? It's no bee. I just thought it would look nice on the wall. I'm that kind of cop. What? The interior decorating kind? You know, I'm sorry. This is actually a nice bird. A competent piece of taxidermy. Well, I can fix it to the plaque and have a new bird in the establishment, I guess. So, I don't know. Thank you. I'm gonna go with thank you. I feel oh. good about our work here today. It's all about the little things, like bringing people random stuffed animals. Bis bis zu little things war das richtig nett und dann war es eine Ansammlung von Bösartigkeiten. It's not actually about that, but he liked it. <laughs> Uh, wir brauchen keine Bill mehr zahlen. Wir haben eine Unterkunft. Goodbye. No. Wir wollten ja. Wir wollten. God, I saw another thing at the wording. Another thing. Great. I love those. Mm. Yes. Ah, ich glaube, wir müssen einfach nur hingehen und dann können wir singen. Finde ich großartig. Nein. Okay, meine Herrschaften, ich hoffe, es hat euch gefallen. Wir werden das nächste Mal Karaoke singen. Vorher sprechen wir vielleicht noch mit Lena und dem Polizisten nochmal. Bis dann. Euch.